Hello all, welcome to this. This is Ringside Unboxing. Two packages, ordered one thing, then went ham, ordered a shit ton. Hopefully that didn't just show, uh, actually I don't give a shit if it showed my address or not. Um, it's not the big WWE and shop, uh, WWE unshop, WWE shop unboxing, but it's a sweet two. Alright, let's, I can't even, I'm trying to remember which figures I ordered. I'm an idiot. Um, let's hope they're not damaged. Trissial orange scissors. Alright, sweet. This one I should have bought two of because I definitely want to take it out. Ah, well, it looks like I'll probably take this one out because it is damaged. Fucking ringside, you suck. Ship your shit more carefully. Most of the people that buy from you don't fucking play with them. Ass clowns. Sami Zayn, the damage is back. Like, that shit pisses me off. Couldn't find this anywhere. It said it was on back order until mid May, but uh, last time I checked, it's not mid May, so it's nice. Um, eh, that's not really. I mean, granted, I would prefer it to be not fucked up, but I'm not gonna take it out just yet. I'm actually, like, out of room for loose figures, so I'm gonna have to start doing some shit. It fucking pisses me off. Pretty good face scan. What do you think, Bobby? I'd say that's pretty good. Oh, and speaking of loose, one of these in this one, I did buy a, a second one so I could take it out. I tr Botchamania! I'm gonna keep that in there, I'm not fucking editing this. Um, I, bought, I couldn't find a second one of these figures anywhere. I never found one in the store to begin with. So, I just went ahead and fucking did it. I'll show that one first. This is the page. I'm gonna open this one. Basically, if you got, I forget what it was, you paid a certain amount and you got a free, Jesus Christ. I still have the Hulk Hogan ones from, uh, that we got outside the Rumble in my trunk. Razor Ramon one. That's not going up anywhere, because, well, maybe I'll put it up in the basement, as you guys saw. I have all those posters. But, uh, it was like, spend something and get a free poster. So I was like, mm, what the hell? And then, to complete this collection, so far, with the ones that are out, I totally forgot I didn't have this. So I bought the Defining Moments Ric Flair. Although, most of the ones you really... Actually, you know what? The new ones, they don't really have like an actual moment like I just realized this like the Hogan one I don't know the Razor Ramon one what the hell is that from the older ones with the bigger packaging like the one I'm looking at now I could see Randy Savage and the Ultimate Warrior theirs are from Wrestlemania 7 their match and then Bret Hart's got the Canadian flag it was from when he was a heel and there's the uh, the Undertaker one the Rock one the Cena one when he had I think both belts so like those are actual moments this is just like Ric Flair in a robe. But whatever. Any damage? No, that's good. And then, I was talking to my buddy Christian, and he was telling me that the Kevin Nash Elite and the Diesel Elite are like ridiculous. Um, ridiculously hard to find and ridiculously high priced. Like, I forgot what he said he, he got a, a deal on them for both, but it was like some ridiculous price. So I figured that those are worth buying. So I bought the, uh, I figured this will be in that same kind of category. Of course, I already find a fucking problem. The Rock. Somehow, if you can see by his sunglasses, that is like a piece of something inside the packaging. It's like a fucking, why can't anything ever just be perfect? It's always gotta be something wrong. This is why I don't like ordering from Ringside, and this is why I always try and find them in the store. But obviously, it's a Ringside exclusive, so you can't really tell. You can see the yellow ladder. That's the one from uh, SummerSlam '98, which I was at, so that's why I like it too. Plus, I'm sure this will be one of the rarer ones to find. 
Maybe I can try and open it and clean that out, because that, that, something like that pisses me off. It's like in there and it just annoys me. And every time I look at this figure, I will look right at that. That's just annoying. This is a sweet figure though. I would buy one to take it out. That's nice, but I didn't. That was it. That's the sweet winter catalog. I didn't get the Edge one. So if anybody's seen the Edge one, the face scan is terrible. So I didn't, I just thought it was, wasn't worth getting. But anyway, well the Sami Zayn package is damaged and the rock's got some little fucked up thing inside of it. But other than that, it's not too bad. Of course the page one, which I'm opening, was the perfect one. No marks on it, nothing. That's my luck.